Welcome to Brain Boost. My name is Christy Goff. I'm a registered dietitian with Pacific Medical Center. And today we're gonna learn about how to keep the brain healthy using food. We're gonna do a cooking demo with sardine recipes. I know I saw some eye rolls out there, but don't worry, this recipe kind of covers that extra fishy taste, making it bright and refreshing for a summer meal. So first, we're going to use our sardines. Um, you can pick this up in any grocery store around, and they're, they're fun because they're in nice little canned, already prepped. Some of them come with extra lemon or extra olive oil. Choose whatever one works for you. So first, we're gonna add sardines. Next, we're gonna put our dressing in. So today we have lemon juice and lemon zest. I'll show you guys to use a lemon zester. It adds another layer of flavor and flair to your recipe. And then we have olive oil and Dijon mustard for ya. So we're gonna add four teaspoons of lemon juice. Two teaspoons of lemon zest. To zest a lemon, all you have to do is get a microplane and simply just back and forth with the lemon. Once we have our lemon juice and lemon zest, we're gonna add our olive oil and Dijon mustard. We just need a teaspoon of each, so a teaspoon of olive oil, and then a teaspoon of Dijon mustard. Any Dijon mustard will work, it doesn't have to be brand specific. Next, we're gonna add a tablespoon of red onion. So once we put our onion in, we're gonna move to our fresh herbs. I strongly recommend using fresh herbs. They add another layer of pizzazz to your food as opposed to dried, which still add flavor, just not as delightful. We're using today basil, mint, and parsley, all of which are really great at breath freshening. We're gonna use our final ingredients, our fresh herbs. We're gonna chop them to two teaspoons each. So now that we have all of our ingredients together, we're gonna take a fork and mash the sardines with all the dressing and onions and fresh herbs. We're gonna mix them until they're nice and flaky. We don't wanna uh, mash them so they're completely pureed. We want a little texture in there. So the reason we choose sardines today is because they do pack a big punch for giving us the right amount of omega-3s. We need omega-3s throughout the week, about two to three times, to really reduce the inflammation burden on our body. You can also use this recipe with salmon or tuna if you would like, but we do really like to honor sardines for their big contributor to the omega-3s, iron, and calcium. I'm glad you joined me today. The PacMed Living Well Alliance is focused on bringing wellness to the community. For other classes on nutrition, wellness, and fitness, visit me at livingwellalliance.org.